good morning students welcome back to rv online classes today i am going to uh, uh, take your second lesson or uh, little the little boy who cried first i want to read the lesson dorin and harry were very happy they had two pounds between them and they were going to buy a new paint box paint box was very old and not very good they had up to 2 pounds to buy one uh, they had seen in the toy shop mummy had also asked them to take her shoes to be mended the cobbler lived next door to the toy shop they went down the road and passed the park on their way running in through the gates was a little boy just as the children passed the gates the small boy tripped over something and fell flat on his face a parcel he carried burst open and out fell sandwiches an orange and a sticky piece of chocolate cake the children heard a tinkle too as if a coin had fallen and rolled away and at the same moment the small boy began to howl doran ran up to the little boy and picked him up he howled hurt his knee and grazed his hands do not cry said dorin dusting his jacket down you are not hurt much bo 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 but my did the dinos all spoilt ailed the little boy and my mama money's lost harry picked up the sandwiches the orange and chocolate cake but they were no good for eating the little boy's dinner certainly was spoiled i had a 50 penny in my hand and that fell and rolled down the drain they wept the little boy oh dear how i am i i to get home it's the first time my mother has let me go out alone and she gave me my dinner to bring to the park and let me have 50 penny to pay for some lemonade and my bus fare home doran and harry did not know what to do the small boy would not stop crying listen said doran suddenly if you stop crying we will buy you some new dinner and give you the money to get home we have 2 pounds we were going to buy a new paint box but we will give you some of the money if you cheer up the little boy wiped his eyes and looked at dore with a smile i like you he said you are kind tell me your name and i will ask my mummy to send you back the money oh no said dorin you needn't bother about that we can spare you the money because it's our very own harry took the small boy to the water fountain and bathed his knee and hands then they went with the him to the baker's shop and bought him two buns a cherry cake and a bottle of lemonade then they bought an apple at another shop harry unwrapped his mother's shoes and carefully wrapped up all the food they had bought in the brown paper he was afraid the little boy would fall down again and spoil everything now i want to explain the lesson 
Dorian and Harry were very happy. Dorian and Harry were very happy. They had two pounds. Here, two pounds. They had two pounds. Pounds means a small unit of money used in United Kingdom or UK between them. And they were going to buy a new paint box. Here, Harry, Doreen and Harry were, they were very happy. And they had two pounds between them. Pounds means here, I already told you, uh, the small unit of money which is used in UK. And they were going to buy a new paint box. They are going to purchase a new paint box. They both loved painting. They loved painting. But their paint box was very old and not very good. It is very old and it is not in a good condition. They had saved up two pounds to buy one they had seen in the toy shop. See her, huh? what they done? They saved the money. They saved the money and they want to purchase one paint box they had seen in the toy shop, which is in the toy shop. Mummy had also asked them to take her shoes to be mended. See her. Huh? Why, anyhow, you are going to purchase a paint box, you must take these shoes to mend them. Mend means here to repair something that is damaged. Here, her shoes are dam get damaged and she want to mend them. So, she said that one. The cobbler lived next door to the toy shop. The cobbler was uh, at the next door of the toy shop where they are purchasing the paint box. They are purchasing the paint box in the toy shop. Next door is the cobbler's shop. They went down the road and passed the park on their way running in through the gates was a little boy. See her? They are passing through that way. There is a Park. There is a park here. Just as the children passed the gates, the small boy tripped over. See here, while they are passing, one little boy was tripped down over. Tripped means you are uh, hit your foot on something and fell. See, while they are moving, they, uh, we are moving. If we hit something, we will fall down. That is known as trip. Something and fell flat on his face. He fell down. The small boy was fell down. A parcel he carried burst open. Here he is carrying something. Parcel means something that is covered in or put in a special envelope paper and sent to somebody. That is known as parcel. And burst out means comes out or it breaks open suddenly. Burst out means it breaks open suddenly. As soon as it fall, he fell down, he, uh, he is uh, with the Parcel which is fell down and burst open. Burst open means um, breaks open. And out fell sandwiches, an orange and a sticky piece of chocolate cake. Uh, in that parcel, what is there? Sandwiches, orange and sticky piece of chocolate cake. The children heard a tinkle too as if a coin had fallen and rolled away. See so here, the children heard tinkle too. Tinkle means uh, here, a short high running uh, or clinking sound. 
sound. When as soon as the coin falls down, it makes some sound while it is rolling. That is known as tinkle. And at the same moment, the small boy began to howl. At the same time, the small boy began to howl. Howl means make a long, sad, crying sound. Because he fell down, he get hurt, so he is making a sound. Sound of crying. Doran ran up to the little boy and picked him up. He had hurt his knee and raised his hands. See here, Dore uh, ran to that boy and he picked him and uh, what he done? <clears throat> and he hurt his knee and grazed the hand, his hands. He got hurt at the knees. knees and uh, grazed means to break the surface of your skin by rubbing it against a rough surface. Do not cry, said the Dore. Uh, dusting his jacket down, you are not hurt much. Now he is saying that, uh, Dore is saying that to boy, don't cry. You are not get hurt so much. But my dinner all spoiled in the little boy and my money also lost. See here what that boy is saying. Okay. Uh, here by, um, I lost my money as well as the dinner also spoiled. <clears throat> Harry picked up the sandwiches, the orange and chocolate cake but they were no good for eating. The little boy's dinner certainly was spoiled. Everything is fell down, so everything is means the dinner is spoiled out. The sandwich, the orange, and as well as chocolate cake, everything is spoiled. Spoiled means or uh, to change something good into something bad or it become useless. I had 50 pennies in my hand and that fell and rolled down uh, that rain day. Back to the little boy. Now what he is saying? Uh, everything. The dinner is spoiled. And I lost 50. Is any also a small unit of money? What he is saying? I lost the money. <clears throat> Where means in the drain. Drain means a pipe or a hole in the ground. That dirty water goes down to be carried away. Poor oh dear, how am I got I to get home? Now, now he is asking uh, Dore how I must go to my home. It's the first time my mother has let me go out alone and she gave me um, my dinner to bring to the park and let me have it. 50 pennies to pay for some lemonade and my bus fare home. See here what he is saying. This is the first time my mother is uh, saying that you must bring your uh, dinner. Ari fare means your charge. Doreen and Harry did not know what to do. I would not stop crying. They are uh, saying that don't cry, but he is not ready to listen. He, he is gone crying. crying. <laughs> New dinner for you. Two pounds. Uh, we are going to buy a new. We are giving you dinner as well as or uh, uh, money to go for your uh, home. 
the little boy wiped his eyes and looked at, at the dorem with the smile now that little boy is wiping his eyes and he is looking at the dorem i like you he said he said i like you you are kind you are kind tell me your name and i will ask mummy to send you back the money now he is saying the little boy is saying uh, you uh, you say your name I, i am asking my mother to send back the money oh no said dorain you needn't bother about that we can spare you the money because it's our very own now what he is saying no there is no need of giving back because it is our own money and spare means not needed now but kept because it may needed in the future saving it is saving harry took the small boy to the water fountain and bathed his knees and hands now harry took the small boy to the water fountain and washed the knees and hands bathed means washing then they went with the him to the baker's shop and bought him two buns a cherry cake and a bottle of lemonade but he took that boy and they uh, bought two buns a cherry cake and a bottle of lemonade lemonade means a beverage of food, sweetened lemon juice mixed with the water i am repeating lemonade means a beverage of sweetened lemon juice with mixed with the water then they bought an apple at another shop harry unwrapped his mother's shoes and carefully wrapped up all the food with they had bought in the brown paper here what he done he unwrapped the shoes for example if you think this one has the shoes first they are wrapped like this now what he done he unwrapped this one and wrapped the food this is known as wrapper and unwrapper and uh, afraid the little boy would uh, what he was afraid the little boy would fall down again and spoil everything now he wrapped and he is handing that one to a little boy and again he started thinking if again he fell down means what will happen there uh, there you are he said how much is your bus fare home after the dorain now he he hand over the uh, dinner now he is asking about the bus fare i already told you what is meant by fare bus fare bus charge 20 pennies said the little boy now he is saying okay it is 20 pennies we we'll here you are said harry giving the little fellow the money put that in your pocket and kept it now he is saying he gave that uh, 20 penny and he is saying you must keep in your pocket and go for your home today i want to stop here itself uh, i want to explain next part of this lesson in next class now i want to write the meanings
use of money used in the UK. Next one, Mendel. To repay something something that is damaged. or broken third one crippled if you are put on Something and fall. Parcel. Something that. Envelope, envelope, paper, I sent somebody. It breaks open for A song, a song, high ringing, high ringing, a thinking song. Long, sad way, sad 
Salmo.
This one is pay. Not needed. Not needed now. But kept the cost. Kept the cost. It may be. It may be needed in future. Needed in. That is saved. Last one, lemonade. A beverage. Lemon juice, sweetened lemon juice, mixed with water. I think you understood the lesson. Now I am giving uh, some homework. Fall 
flat on the ground flat on the ground while they are moving at the gates they saw the one boy has tripped at the gate so whether it is a true or false you must say that one third one dore and harry decided to ignore the boy ignore means carelessly leaving him carelessly but they they helped that boy so it is true or false you must say that one next Thank you. Have a nice day.